is uh, which is one of my favorite rudiments, and uh, it's America's favorite rudiment. Officially voted in Modern Drummer as the best rudiment of the uh, 90s. 99 was voted. It was voted top rudiment. Here we go. Let's dive right in. Radim a cue. The word is modeled after uh, the sound it will recreate. Radim a cue is technically an onomatopoeia. So let's dive right in. It's going to start with a flam. For example, start with your right, accenting the left. Flam. That represents rat. Right, left, right. A uh, ma cue. Rat a ma cue. Okay. Let's try that all together. Two, six, seven. Rat a ma cue. It's a triplet. Start with your left hand now. Rat a ma cue. So it goes left, right, left, right, left. So practice it with your metronomes and speed it up. I would start at about 65 BPMs, beats per minute. All right, and well, that's the end of the lesson, except for my favorite and your favorite, the shaker. Oh, where's my shaker? Where's my shaker? Oh. This is a Rhythm Tech Studio shaker. Uh, I'm going to teach you how to do a 16th note accent on the downbeat shaker beat. You're going to accent 1, 2, e and a 3, e and a 4. All right, so let's try it. You're going to accent You accent it by putting a more centrifugal force behind your shake. Proper position is you're going to use elbow, wrist, fingers. No shoulder. Five, six, seven. If you'll notice, I'm raising my hand higher on the accents. The top of the canister has more high-end resolution. You can't accent it down here. Listen. You can't even decipher. Thirty-second notes. They call it a uh, rhythm tech studio shaker because the method of enticing the, the sonic sounds out of it is by shaking. Ooh.